Y'all tune in to Real Life Street Stars and make sure you go get that app off of Google Play. Download it now. Real life street stars, man. We in this thing with STC Mafia, man. What's good, man? What's good, man? Hey, the first time I heard STC Mafia was my boy uh, Dwayne Vega started right here. You know what I'm saying on the battle rap shit, man. Go ahead, go through and introduce everybody real quick. Yeah, I'm Flash Jordan. Uh, everything is super, totally extreme celebrity. Hey, man, I'm Dwayne Vega, man. STC Mafia, man. Hey, my battle, October 29th, live from the block, is going down. Come fuck with me. I'm, I'm catching bodies. Let's get it, man. Man, I'm Woo, man. You know, appreciate that. Yeah, I'm Woo. You know what I'm saying? STC Mafia. You know, everything is Mafia with me. That's all I got to say about my introduction. Hey, this your boy Mafia Race. You know what I'm saying? The motherfucking swag lord. I'm with my young celebs, we in this bitch. Y'all fuck with us, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Man. So Flash Jordan, man, hey, uh, we talking off camera and we had your project in our hand, man. Explain the project, let them know what the name is and everything. What you got going? Yeah, my project is uh almost famous. You know, cause I feel like I'm almost famous and I'm speaking things into existence. So my next project is the fame because the fame is coming soon and uh i'm just keeping everything extreme man like everything is totally what is it that you have spoken into existence um i'm speaking the fame into existence like when you say things you can speak it into existence so i'm saying i'm almost famous because i really want the fame so hey uh backstory how did y'all end up meeting man how'd y'all click up we grew up together, like where uh, we're at in a small town, Ferris, Texas. You know, it's um, it's down forty five, but forty five south, and it's it's very small, like a very small town. Like the population is like two thousand, maybe. Like I have more followers than I have like people that live in my town, so it's crazy. <laughs> so how did y'all make it out of that, man? How did y'all um, you know? get to the point where y'all got to the to the local rap scene in Dallas. You know what I'm saying? Man, it was like extremely hard because like you stuck in this small town. So it's like, man, like will we ever get out of this town? And it's like you digging yourself out of a hole and finally you get out the hole, you know, you just got to keep moving. Like, like it's just, it's crazy. Like it's a crazy struggle, but you have to go through it. Living in poverty, like it's crazy, man. Man, give me one throw ass story from Ferris, Texas, man. <laughs> man. Man. I don't know, like the oh no, man. It's just I don't even know. <laughs> like Man, we it was about four of us, man. We we smoking out the car, man, like about five blunt shit. The law pull up. He tell us roll down the windows, man. We like, damn, you know what I'm saying? He, we roll them down, a cloud come out the car. Man, real shit, he look at us, he say, I know y'all smoked it all, so I'ma just, I'ma just go. He drove <laughs> off, bro. We looked at each other like, it's like, shit, what? Shit, we left, but yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's a lot of shit, man. It's, it's a, we can sit here all day, really. Man, tell us a day in the life of Ferris, man. Like, what what is it like? Is it like Dallas, where you know niggas be hating on each other? There's a lot of rappers out there. Like, like, what is it like? I mean, it's it's a lot. Uh, you know, seven shots. That what shit. We know cuz from Ferris, Texas. You know what I'm saying? But hey, it, we really the the ones doing it right now, trying to trying to make Ferris what it is. Shit, it's it's country. You know what I'm saying? Really. Just dirt roads, there ain't no red lights, like shit. I mean, you know what I'm saying? It ain't no hate out there. I, I see how y'all can stand out in a country town, bro. I really see that. Bro. Yeah. 
I mean, like I was saying, it really ain't no hate out there, but some people don't agree with what we doing, what we got going, but you know, it's just like, fuck it. We gonna do what we wanna do anyway. That's what separates us from everybody else. Yeah, you know like we, we treat it like it's our town. Like that's like our word, you know what I'm saying? It's like, we own it, you know what I'm saying? We celebrities, like we small town celebrities. That's why we came up with that name, you know, because we from a small town and we always feel like we was the celebrities of it like so just running around there as a as a young kid was crazy though man but, hey i got something to add to that you know what i'm saying because i'm from even smaller town i'm from ferris too but i'm from a smaller town called italy and that shit there is terrible <laughs> like it's worse than ferris so like when i came to ferris i was like shit, probably like 18 but I had new flash racks because my dad from Ferris. I knew them. And then I met Cuz over here. And it was like, damn. Like, we all linked up with each other. Like, we all had something in common. So it was all crazy how life works. Yeah, you know like, I mean? like I've been knowing him since, and then, you know, since I was 12 years old. You know what I'm saying? Like, we used to wear the same jerseys to school, like, back in the day, man. We been on this swag shit, like, trying to outdress everybody. Like, like, we trying to kill you like that's what we trying to do like if we come through like we trying to we trying to kill the scene like we trying to be them dudes you know what i'm saying like that's what we want like like we want the fame and the money like we want it all bro like we from a small town like we from we trying to get it man like we coming like i say man this battle rap shit that shit i'm killing man i'm i'm coming hey i was gonna touch on that man which one of y'all pushed Dwayne vega to uh to do the battle rap shit <laughs> Shit, we all did, really. Yeah. Really. yeah. He ain't never really just did that shit, but he do that shit, you know what I'm saying? Because niggas don't know about Vega. That boy is just raw, you know what I'm saying? He can do it all. Like, he can go in the booth and just drop a whole song right right now. Like, and then, uh, off the dome. Like, Diego Cruz, that... Cruzy. That, that's my Cruzy. competition, man. That boy, he gonna eat, so... He, he pushed me like yeah that's that boy made me into a beast i give him a lot of credit man yeah but th that's what i do man i rap like i ain't trying to work i ain't trying to do shit i'm trying to rap get money get paid to rap man that's the goal man for me yeah i remember man uh when we had the battle the battle was right here it was uh i can't remember what the name of it was and it was uh my homegirls was upstairs, man, and their favorite battle rapper was you at the time. They was like, man, that yeah. nigga, we well, just swagged out, man. He, just the way you was rapping, they like that shit, man. Like, where you get your style from? You know what I'm saying? Like, who influenced y'all growing up? Man, I, you sound like some pimp C or something. Like, just, <laughs> just fashion, bro. Yeah. We like fashion, like, like really, man. This, this the, this the swag. You, they, you want to talk to him? That's the swag, man, right there, man. Like. He keep me fly. He put me swag on game. Lord. Yeah, that's Swag Lord. He, yeah, he keep Mark me on game. He yeah. keep me fly, man. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, but yeah, yeah. that's we what we, up, we trying to kill people with that swag shit, though, man. But nobody stands out more than Flashy, though. Oh. Flashy, what, what, what the fuck, Flash? Like, my nigga coming here with uh with the Dennis Rodman. <laughs> <laughs> The 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 polar the old school Polaroid cam. Yeah, the nigga with the leopard vest, man. You. What's with the the Polaroid camera? Yeah, yeah. What is yeah, the you know, the I symbolism? Take pictures, man. Like somebody taking picture of me, I would like to take a picture of you know. What I'm yeah. Does it it work? Nah, I had bought film for it, and they said I had to like send it to like Japan, and I was like, wow, like <laughs> Japan? Oh my god! Get like, some racks for that hoe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to sell it like for real, <laughs> like. Antique. But yeah, like my inspiration is like for real Kanye West. Like I love for real style. Like it's extreme, and it's like I want to like be better than for real. Like that's my idol, so I would like to be better than him. Like take it to a whole nother level, you know. But yeah, that's really what you know. I took some of his style and I put it with mine, and it created Flash Jordan. You ever catch any hate? Of course, like I, yeah, of course, you know, fishnets and shit, dog. these Kylie Kendall shorts. Shit, dog. These is Kylie Jenner shorts, you know, yeah, Kylie Kendall shorts. Like, yeah, you know, you said you, say you love that shit. Why y'all? Why you love yo, it so man. much? Cause I love the attention. Like I love the attention. You know, That's like let them know, let them know. Yeah, like the fame, bro. Like man, step, you both need to step your swag up real time. Yeah, like we really, we we really why, shitting. You, like you we really shitting. That's what it really is. But 
How how important is swag to the swag lord? <laughs> I mean, it's all about your appearance. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If I come to you with a CD, and I'm all bummy and shit, you know what I'm saying? And, it, and it be like that sometimes, you know what I'm saying? But a motherfucker gonna wanna fuck with you if they see you on your shit, you know what I'm saying? And that's just common sense. Everybody know that shit, you know what I'm saying? I don't take a rocket song to see that shit, you know what I'm saying? Hey, let's let's it's play. All about your appearance. Bro. Let's play a game. Who had more swag, Cam, Cameron, or Fabulous? Ah, Cam. <laughs> Cam. Cam, bro. Cam. Fa- Fabulous had the throwbacks though. That nigga, that nigga had some throwbacks, man. But like back in the day though, when yeah. when Cam was rocking the uh the Super Bowl jacket and, and pink minks, All nobody shit. was like yeah, effing was, with Cam, man. Like he, he set a trend, like yeah, the he was the first one that just jumped out there with the paint. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. So man, like, what is a um, what is a recording session with y'all like, man? Like, like, like y'all, what do y'all, you know, what do y'all like to do, man? Just who who's gonna rap, you know? what I'm Saying like, what do y'all do? Y'all write? Y'all just get in there freestyle? What is y'all's process like? Like I write, but like I write a bunch of hooks. I write, but like I write a bunch of hooks. So it's like a song full of hooks, you know, like. Really, no verses. I'm just saying a bunch of hooks. So, like, let me add to that. That's what I feel like, cause like everybody raps, man. Anybody can rap, and it's these days. It's not even they not even rapping. They mumbling and and just singing. But it's, I feel like as long as you got a beat and a hook, that's that's what you need. And I'm gonna come with them lyrics, like, cause I really rap. Like, can't nobody fuck with me on this rap shit. Like, I don't care who you are. Go get them. Like, bring them here. I, line them up. Speaking of rap, you said you got a battle coming up. Yeah, October 29th. Um, what's that next Saturday? Yeah. Versus Sam Quinn. Yeah. Hey, that's going to be live, man. Check it know. out. It's going to be totally, totally extreme. Hey, shout totally out extreme. From the block, man. Shout out Osama, man. He put, hey, he opened a lot of doors, man. Hey, how did you, um, um, how did you end up uh, clicking up with Live from the Block specifically? Oh. Um, I know there's two battle leagues out here, you know. Shit. Um,. I think I was on some battle page on Facebook and uh I think it was Bryce Fellow, he he told me to hit up Osama because I had I had said I wanted to battle or whatever, cause I ain't never did it, but I always rapped or whatever. And yeah, I, I hit up Osama, man. He he would he set it up. So shit, that's where it went from, man. Yeah. Shout out, man. I've been able to you know, been fortunate to record all your battles and watch you grow, man. Yeah, and I, yeah, you know, and, yeah, that, and 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 you were definitely one of the fan favorites, man. So that's 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 a good thing. Anyone, anybody else trying to jump in? You know what I'm saying? Y'all what the battle? Yeah, the battle scene. Y'all, y'all nah, nah, <laughs> yeah, that, nah. That's the good thing about it though, cause like I feel like we all around with it, man. Like, yeah, like he do his music, I got my music. Like we got all, like it's all around, man. Like, like we, crew is going full throttle on any track. And like you know, he's like the slim shady of our group. Like yeah, nobody is compared to him but Lyric. slim shady. Lyric. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, we just all around, man. We we got every style, man. Like just so, what it is. So like uh, somebody watching this interview saying, "Damn, I want to check out some STC Mafia." You know, saying some music. What's what's the first three songs you would tell them to go check out? Um. <clears throat> I just did a song called Hundred Million on My Mind. Um, it's featuring a couple of my homies on there from from uh I grew up with. Then uh me and Rex, we got a song called Mafia. It's hot. So lit. Um, yeah, everything so mafia, man. And uh we got a lot of shit on the way. But yeah, yeah we got a uh S T C Mafia mixtape coming soon, man. We ain't got a drop date on it, but we got a lot of shit. And uh Vega just dropped a uh, song called I Cannot. It's on my SoundCloud, at Flash Jordan, F-L-A-S-H-E, Jordan. Everything is Flash Jordan. Social, cl- uh, social was it? All social media, SoundCloud, iTunes, everything. So you can up. check it out. That's what's up. Any, anyone, uh, Rags, uh, uh, my boy over here, y'all got any projects? Drop <clears throat> Yeah, like he said, me and Vega working on the project right now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We finna do that. Then after that, you know what I'm saying? Got my boy Wu coming in. You know what I'm saying? Let me let you chop it up. Yeah, 
with Ashley, you know what I'm saying? Because it's, it's throw because, like, this ain't even all of us. This is the core. Mm. But, like, uh, I went to the studio the other day and dropped a little song called My Young Nigga. Of course, you're going to have to edit it for the radio or whatever, but shit. I got that. Then I want to uh, I want to do my own little mixtape, just self-entitled Woo. Like, I already got it figured out. I got this little color, uh, the cover of Rick Fleur, and it say Woo in yellow letters. You know, that's my name. You know, with Rick Fleur is known for saying Woo. You know, so yeah. shit, that's what I want to do. Then, Man. like... I'm good with my lyrics, but I'm gonna talk about like some real shit. Cause like I done went through some hardships in this past year. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like some real tough shit. Like my son passed away and shit last Damn, year. It's terrible. So yeah, like I'm gonna talk about some real shit. Like yeah, I'm gonna give you what you asking for, but I'm gonna give you that real shit too. Real like shit. that's what I'm about. Real shit. Hey right, man, uh, what's the first thing y'all gonna do when Trump win this election? <laughs> When Trump win, boy, I don't know. You know he gonna win. win. I'm gonna try to get rich faster. Like <laughs> I'm gonna try to get like rich, like super fast, and like just like you know take care of uh, a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? Because it's gonna be like super crazy. So, man, man what do you feel about the elections, though, bro? Man, it's like the way I see it. Hold on, my bad, players. The way I see it, we fucked. <laughs> like we been we been fucked, but like we grown now and we see like what's going on. So it's like, oh man, this is really happening in front of us. I see it like <laughs> we're voting for like a bunch of like entertainers. Like they all want the fame. They both want the fame. Like Hillary gonna do whatever she wanna do. Like she have to do to become the first female president. And then and Donald like, Trump just want the fame and money. Like, like what the hell has Trump ever done political <laughs> anyway? So. I just want the fame and money too, I'm not gonna lie. So in that in that sense, can you kind of feel him? <laughs> oh, yeah, you, yeah, you set yourself up for that one right there. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but uh, man, um, Vega, man, you ever um think about traveling with the battle rap shit, man? I know we got Poison Pen coming out, man, and uh, you know, shit, you like one step away from getting on that smack stage with a crazy performance. You know what I'm saying, like. It's- uh, I mean, I ain't trying to sound cocky, but I, I'm trying to get paid, bro. Like, that's the goal, man. Like, so, you know, I don't like flying on planes, you know what I'm saying? You, gonna have to, you probably got to pay me, man. Like, that's what I'm going for. Like, yeah, that's I want real to, shit. you know, with that money, like, man. Yeah. And that's just real shit, because, I mean, I got a family to feed, man. Real shit. Yeah, like, we've been, like, it just been a hobby for us for, like, so long. And it's like, now, man. We re- we ready to get paid on our t- for our talent, you know. And that's like with the battle shit. Like, I really just was a fan. Like, I like doing it. And I knew I could rap. I like watching it. I mean, but yeah. Um, so I just really wanted to see if I could do it and shit. When I did it, it went so well, man. It was like, why not keep doing it? Make a name for myself, man. And shit, like I said, October 29th, man. I'm. I got another one on the way, man. Yeah, yeah. Man, that's what's up, man. Hey, what's what's the upcoming projects uh y'all got coming up? <clears throat> I know Flash you got a, he got almost famous coming. You talked about your other project. I, yeah, I got the fame coming. Uh, almost famous. You know, I got that's Angel Brinks on the cover. Oh she, yeah. She's from Basketball Wives of LA. Um I met her in LA at uh LAX. You got a smiling on here, you look yeah, like you, you said something to her. <laughs> Yeah, we were chopping it up for like 20 minutes, and uh, we took two pictures together. So I was like, well, I'm almost famous, so I'm going to put her on the cover. <laughs> like, she's hot, so, you know what I'm saying? She's popping. So I'm like, hey, you know, so the fame coming. The, fa- yeah. the fame cover probably have, uh, I took a picture with Miley Cyrus' brother, Trey Cyrus. So I'm thinking about throwing that on the cover. Hey, yeah, I'm looking at the album cover, man. I'm looking at the, the track list, man. Um you got a song on her TMZ. <laughs> yeah, what like what is that about? Um, God damn it. Paparazzi following me, yeah. like TMZ. You know, like that's it's it's like a dream. Like I put my fantasies and dreams in my music, so that is my dream. That's my goal to have TMZ following me. So let's say let's say Flash hit the lotto, man. You get about you know five hundred milli. What's the first shit you gonna spend it on, bro? The first thing. First thing you gonna cop. Man, like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, wow, like a house, like for my for my people, you know, What's house up? for my people. A tour bus come. I always be on the road. I'm always be traveling. 
I'm never gonna be at home, but I'm gonna have my family in the house. And of course, a Lamborghini. That's my first, That's my dream car. Yeah, like, and I gotta take care of my partner. So that was saying. I got like a lot of people I have to take care of. Yeah. Like I have a whole town on my back. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying. Hey, let me ask you about the um the game specifically as far as the uh, the rap game. Um, uh, do you like what you're hearing? You know what I'm saying. How do you feel about it? Yeah, I love it. Like I love the new artists. Yeah. Um, I love it. Yeah. Like I always loved it. You know. So you ain't one of them old heads It's like Nah, nah Turn that shit off you, Nah you Nah nah, with, nah I like uh, Lil Yachty You know Lil Boat yeah. Lil Uzi Shout out to Lil Uzi He cool I met him At yeah. South by Southwest uh, Go Yayo yeah, Shout out to all of them Man I like it I love it Yeah So what what would you say Is the goal for STC Mafia As a whole You know what I'm saying <clears throat> Shit We trying to get rich man. Like yeah. We want the money, man. Like money in the fame, money so in the fame, money in the fame. Yes, man. Like pretty much, we we trying to get rich, man. Like fame, fame, fame. You would never want to put. Trying to let the world see, man. Like that's what's up, bro. That's what's up. Shit. Uh, you got any shout outs? Shit. Shout out that boy Diego Cruz, man. Shout out. He my boy. STC Mafia too, huh? He STC Mafia, oh, man. Shout out my boy Ice Man. PZP, right? PZP Productions, hey. Oh, Santana Jones, y- YTPC, that's my clique, man. My mom hey, on TV. The whole squad, man. Shout out Ferris, Texas. Everybody in Ferris, Texas, man. Yeah, shout out to Ferris, Texas, man. I am Ferris Bueller. Shout out to Ferris, Texas. Uh, just keep it extreme, man. Like, check out my haircut real quick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, who who cut your hair, bro? And how oh, long man. does it take to get that motherfucker? Man, thing? shout out to my homie P Red. Uh, he cold, man. Um, it took about an hour and a half, like, and then it just came out so super extreme. I just, you know, I don't know. I threw some magic going in, and it came out like this. <laughs> man, what, that, that man, boy hey, well, I'm just, I'm just curious, bro. What does Flashy do, like, when he take his date out? Like, what, what extreme shit do you, you take a bitch on a jet? Like, bitch, you just gonna jump out? Like, what man, kind of? <laughs> hey, if I had a jet, we will, we would a skateboard like off the plane, like with a parachute, <laughs> like literally, like with you a parachute, skateboard, skateboard off, the off the. But like a date with me is just cool. Like we're just gonna keep it extreme. Like I'm not gonna like, you know, I put on like a collar shirt or something. I wouldn't, you know, come out. <laughs> I wouldn't come like extra extreme, you, don't you come know, to on Papa the date. Nose. Yeah, <laughs> fishnet. Yeah. print. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fishnet, no shirt. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's the throatest drug you ever seen a nigga on? <laughs> yeah, I done seen. Acid. Yeah, we just yeah acid. Uh, acid like XO, like Xanax. <laughs> yeah, you ever have to pull your nigga aside and be like, "Come on, bro." Plenty of time. Yeah. Of time. We all, I think we all done had to get pulled aside at one point. Like, Hold on, man. God damn. Be yeah, man. Uh, table or like <laughs> but yeah, man. Um, yeah, I performed at Vince Warp Tour. You know, fifteen. Yeah. So that was extreme. That was cool. That was like one of my dreams come true. Yeah, I met the owner of Vans, man. Shout out to Vans. Shout out to Steve Van Door and Kevin Lyman, man. Yeah, they cool people, man. Yeah, like, we're super we're cool. Like, like, <laughs> like, young rock stars, man. Yeah. Like, we trying to get it. We trying to get rich, man. I'm going to say it again, man. That, he he, he must have liked that tat on your chest there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how I met um the owner of Vans. Like, Kevin Lyman, he's the creator of the Warp Tour that they have every year. I flew to uh Florida. Met him, and he personally invited me to the uh, warp tour. Do you, do you get free vans? Yeah, I have got uh, free vans I'm about to before. Say you yeah, hey, yeah, of course. Show him your chest. Nigga. I'm really yeah, about this vans life, bro. Like I went to New York, Florida, all on vans. You know what I'm saying? Like, shout out to vans, man. They cool people. Like, that shit crazy. Man, shit. Um, give him your social media. Everything Flash Jordan. Instagram Flash Jordan. Snapchat Flash Jordan iTunes, Flash Jordan, Spotify, Flash Jordan, everything Flash Jordan, all social media, Flash Jordan, at Flash Jordan, Flash Jordan. Hey, man, t- shout out for you saying Spotify. I'm about to check you out, man. That Spotify changed my life, man. Yeah, I, I man. can change it's, Everybody should know. It's super that extreme. Shit is, that shit extreme. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you go Dwayne Vega on Facebook, uh, Mr. No Feelings on Instagram, and then 
go on YouTube, type in LFTB, Dwayne Vega, if you want to see my battles or any other battles, if you're in the battle rap or whatever, I do both, man, and I'm good at both, and I mean that when I say it, but yeah, man, that's what it is, man. Say, uh, shit, I don't even remember my Instagram shit. <laughs> Nigga loaded. <laughs> I barely be on that shit, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, and what's my shit? Uh, SCC Mafia underscore Rex. I be on that whole flex in a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I went to go see Kanye the other day when he came to the AAC, you know what I'm saying? So, you're gonna see a lot of that on there. Shit, you know what I'm saying? You can uh, get on that home, buy some of my swag, you know what I'm saying? Y'all can have that shit. All that old shit, y'all can have that. My Facebook, you know, is Woo Hover, Woo W O O H O L B O R T, Snapchat, Kimi 987, Instagram, Stay Froze 09. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I almost forgot. I got a YouTube channel. It is Evander Hover, E V A N D E R, Evander like Holyfield. And I will whoop your ass like Holyfield. <laughs> Had to throw that out there. <laughs> but uh, Evander Hover, go ahead and look it up. All right, ready? Yeah, you can just Google like Flash Jordan, all that shit will pop up, bro. Oh yeah, like all of it pop up. That's what it, that's what it do, man. Hey, STC Mafia, y'all as a whole, y'all lost some real life street stars. Already. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate, it. appreciate the love. Yes, sir.